Hello, Tulare County. This is Tammy Weicker Adkins. I'm the Public Information Officer for Tulare County Health and Human Services Agency. And today I am here with Dr. Sharon Minnick, who is our Tulare County Public Health Epidemiologist. So we're here and we're going to talk about a couple of items. Now, first of all, um, I've read on the CDC website that you can potentially catch the COVID-19 virus by being in close contact with someone. What does that actually mean? So according to CDC, being in close contact means being approximately six feet away from someone who is infectious, the COVID-19 case, um, six feet or two meters, and this is for a prolonged period of time, not just passing by briefly in the hallway or on the street, but actually being close to them for those a, a prolonged period of time, several minutes at least. Close contact can occur, for example, when you're caring for someone or living with someone in the same household who is a case or, or sharing a healthcare waiting room, for example. Okay. Another way that you could become a close contact is if you are near close contact and you become, um, you have contact with their infectious secretions. Okay, now what does that mean actually? <laughs> so for instance, if they cough on you. Oh, okay, so it's like what you're expelling. Exactly. All right. Okay, that makes a lot of sense. Now, another question um, that I might have is we have quite a few people at, the t at this time that are in what's called self-quarantine. Now, what does that mean and what's involved with that? Right. So, self-quarantining is what people need to do if they have had an exposure to someone with COVID-19 so that they can separate themselves from other people and not continue to spread the disease if they should become symptomatic. So in order to self-quarantine, that means you're staying at home, you should separate yourself as much as possible from the others in your household. So if you can stay in one room, if you can have your own bathroom during that time, if that's available, those are good things. You should not share personal items, don't share toothbrushes, try to limit contact as much as you can with the others in your household so you don't continue to spread the disease. Um, you can wash laundry, you can launder your clothes and, and bed linens and things like that using um, hot water and soap. You should also wash your hands with soap and water as, as much as possible. And measure your temperature twice a day, so you need to have a thermometer. And also uh, monitor yourself for your symptoms if you are developing a cough, a fever, any of these other symptoms. Well, that makes it a little bit more clear. Thank you so much, and thank you, Tulare County.